and just becoming aware of the body, becoming aware of the breath, noticing where the breath is situated. And without judging it, just imagining the breath going a little bit lower into the body. Every breath you take is connecting you deeper and deeper and deeper within yourself, finding the center within. Asking the mind to relax, to let go of any thoughts, any attachments to any outcomes. Just fully going into the body, the sensations of the body, asking the body to open up, asking the body to relax. And just imagine that you have the ability to connect to the earth. I like to imagine in the center of the earth that there is a beautiful crystal temple. And just imagine that with the power of your intention, you can connect to this crystal energy from the base of your spine, imagining a beautiful column of light moving through all the layers of the earth, connecting in with that beautiful crystal energy in the center of Mother Earth. And just use the power of the breath. Every inhalation is pulling up that beautiful crystal energy through all the layers of the earth into your physical body. Just imagine filling up your pelvic area with all of this beautiful crystal energy and just holding it in that part of your body, accumulating with every breath more crystal energy. And just imagine that the base of your spine, where your root chakra is located, is also the physical location where we hold the energy of safety and security, a sense of belonging. And just pulling up that crystal energy through the layers of the earth into that first energy center with the intention to bring softness, to bring healing. Noticing if there is any fear-based energy in relationship to your safety and security within yourself, within relationships, in the world. Every breath is a healing movement, bringing in more of that energy into the body. Asking the body to work with you, to really open up on the deepest cell level. Asking the body to show you if there is any fear, anything stored in that part of your body, any frozen energy. And just imagine a healing wave moving into the body. And on the exhale, just imagine that you can let that energy that is ready to be released, just let it flow back into the earth for healing and transformation.
Anything that has to do with your sense of belonging, safety, security. Notice if there is any energy that is linked to fear, frustration, anger. Every breath is a healing movement. On the exhale, just use the voice to release it into the earth. Just let it go. Let it flow out of the body. And using the power of your imagination, now imagine that column of light that is connected to the center of the earth using that column of light to pull up crystal energy into the body and this time pulling it all the way up to the top of your head from the base of the spine all the way up to the top of your head imagine that energy moving through every cell of your body with the intention to discover, to explore if there is any fear-based energy in any of the body parts, any of your cells, and just really asking your body to work with you, to open up. Do this a couple more times where you are inhaling with the intention to look for any fear-based pockets of frozen energy in the body. And now set your intention that you have the power to send it into the earth for healing and transformation, to clear your cell memory from anything that is ready to be released in this now moment. And just becoming aware of the body, focusing all of the attention on the top of your head. And I want you to feel into connecting with the source of creation, the great central sun, Imagining the column of light extending from the top of your head, connecting in with the great central sun. Using the power of the breath and allowing the energy from the great central sun to pour down through the crown chakra all the way down to the base of the spine and connecting in with the energy of the earth. And imagine using your energetic eyes to see yourself standing in the center of that column of light that is connected to the energy above you and the energy below you. And using the power of the breath using the power of your imagination. Notice how every breath is expanding this column of light, expanding it beyond the edges of your physical body. Imagine it extending about six feet on all sides of the body. The front, the back, the left, the right, and just notice with your energetic eyes that you are standing in the center of this powerful column of light. Setting your intention to bring clarity, coherence, harmony in all parts of the body, all the energy centers, the organs, all the systems of the body. And 
and feeling a wave of gratitude for your physical body. Thanking the body for assisting you in opening up on a deeper level so that you can find pockets of frozen energy that are ready to be released. And this is a good time to call in your energetic support team in whatever way, form, or shape they appear to you. This could be guides, guardians, power animals. And just ask them to amplify and fortify all of your intentions today. Imagine them opening up their hearts and infusing and surrounding this column of light with you in the center of it that they are amplifying and fortifying this beautiful column of light with the energy of unconditional love. And just notice what it feels like to receive unconditional love. Unconditional love from Mother Earth, from the Great Central Sun, and from any and all of the guides that you have called in. Noticing that this goes beyond any human love that you have ever experienced. Tapping into a new level of unconditional support and love. And I want to invite you to make a connection with your baby self inside your mother's womb space. So just imagine using the power of your intention and attention. Imagine that you have a clear view on what is going on inside of the womb space. What is going on in your parents' life? What is your mother experiencing? while she was pregnant with you? What is the baby picking up? Is there any anxiety, any fear, any stress? Perhaps there is discomfort or pain. And just focus all of your attention on the baby self inside of the womb space. And just imagine what this baby is picking up right now. And I want you to place a bubble of energy around the baby self inside of the womb space because we are going to help, help the baby self to not be affected by whatever is going on outside of this womb space. Imagine that you are placing this beautiful bubble of energy around the baby, also around the placenta and the umbilical cord. And imagine opening up your heart, sending unconditional love to the baby self in this now moment. Also imagining giving the baby self more space. Just imagine that you are placing the baby inside the infinite womb of creation. Give the baby all the space, all the space it needs to move around, to express itself and open up the line of communication. Open up the line of communication with the baby self. 
and introduce yourself. Tell them that you are the future self. Tell them what year it is, what month it is, and that you have come in with the intention to bring support and guidance, to take away any pressure, to take away any effects of the childhood programming. Communicate with the baby that you are here to reset the template to the authentic core signature of your soul self. And if you have any guides or guardians with you, ask them to also send a wave of unconditional love to the baby self in this now moment. Use your energetic eyes to scan the baby's body for any contraction, any part that feels numb or desensitized. Just imagine that every breath is bringing in life force. bringing in oxygen and blood flow in all the right places, opening up these pockets of frozen energy. Imagine that with every breath, this baby is becoming more luminous, more able to absorb this wave of unconditional love that you are sending in this now moment. Imagine the baby smiling, really open to receiving all of this unconditional love in this now moment. And have a conversation with your baby self. Explain that you are here to rewrite part of the story. to invite the baby self to step onto a new timeline with you. And share with the baby self what your intention for your relationships are. What is your vision of the future? relationships that have healthy, loving communication. Will you bring all the shadow frequencies into the light? A vision of attracting somebody that is going to amplify all the joy and happiness. your vision of taking the purpose of relationships to the next level. And now it's time to invite all the younger selves into this exercise. Whatever age you are in this now moment, go back one year and invite that part of you to join you in a beautiful healing circle and bring in all the younger selves two years ago three years ago four years ago five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen years ago all the way back to when you were a newborn baby. And perhaps you would like to imagine that the newborn baby and the one-year-old 
self or being supported by a beautiful guardian or a guide or maybe an aspect of you that really wants to take care of the youngest ones. And use the power of your imagination to see yourself in a healing circle. All aspects of you are present in this healing circle. You in the now moment, all the way back, all the different ages until you were a newborn baby. And introduce yourself in the circle. Tell all aspects of you who you are, where you are from, and why you are here. And you in the now moment, please scan the whole circle, really tuning in to all the different ages. And just imagine that you energetically can see where these aspects of yourself were in judgment. Judgment of self, judgment of others. Also tuning into any energies of feeling a victim. A victim of circumstances. And as you go around the circle, I want you to offer all the younger selves the opportunity to speak up, to express themselves. Just give them a voice. Tune into their energy. What was challenging for them at all these different ages? What was challenging in regards to relationships and relationship dynamics? And especially tuning into the energy of punishment, possession, control, manipulation. And you in the now moment, I want you to place all of your focus on the solar plexus. Noticing what is going on in the physical body as you tune into all of your experiences throughout your whole life when it comes to possession, control, manipulation. And tune into the circle, all the different ages, and try to go back all the way to that first moment. One of those first moments where you felt that somebody or something was trying to control or manipulate you. Where you were not able to speak up and express your authentic yes or your authentic no. And just imagine, in this beautiful column of light, tapped into the Earth's energy, that you are able to pull up that crystal energy into the body, all the way into the solar plexus, on the front side and the back side, of the solar plexus. And as you pull it in for you in the now moment, you are leading by example. 
every breath is an invitation for all the different ages to take a deep breath in together with you as one breath, a collective breath into the solar plexus with the intention to clear and cleanse to let go of any and all of these energies that are linked to control, manipulation, possession, and just sending them into the earth for healing and transformation. Opening up the line of communication with all the younger selves, inviting them to really let go of any and all of these energies that are causing any contraction or restriction in the solar plexus. Imagine that beautiful crystal energy coming up with every breath you take like a healing wave cleansing and clearing out the solar plexus. And just notice if there are any cords of connection linked to any person, any event, any circumstance, any addiction or any habits, any patterns. And imagine in this moment, setting a clear intention to release yourself from all of these cords of connection that are linked to control, manipulation, possession. Just imagine sending it back, releasing it from the physical body, from your energy field, using the power of the breath. And just imagine pulling back your power, reclaiming your power back in the solar plexus. Imagine that this beautiful column of light around the circle is also preventing any of these connections to stay there. After you made the distinct decision to release them, just imagine them disappearing from your reality. It doesn't matter where they came from. They're just going back to their point of origin. And just pulling it all back into the solar plexus. All of your power, all of your life force, your ability to speak up for yourself, your ability to stand up for yourself. And just imagine that you are pulling in that energy from the center of the earth into the solar plexus. You in the now moment and all the different ages are doing this simultaneously. One unified breath in. And just imagine connecting the energy of the solar plexus with the energy of your communication center located in the throat. Imagine activating your ability to speak up. All the different ages are getting the same opportunity in this now moment. And just lead by example. Take a deep breath in and on the exhale, please make a sound. Open up the voice as you exhale. And as you do, you are giving all the younger selves full permission to make a sound. So deep breath in, exhaling and using the voice. A couple more times, deep breath in.
exhaling using the voice. Two more times, deep breath in. Open up the voice as a collective, everyone in the circle. Each age, every aspect of you is given full permission to use the voice. One last time, deep breath in. And using the voice. Now imagine moving through the circle, scanning the circle, and asking if there is one aspect of you, a specific age, that needs extra attention, that needs extra help. Going back to a point of origin where you, on some level, shut down. Shut down your self-expression, your authentic yes or no. And for some of you, that might be all the way back to a very early age or even when you were in the womb space. And just imagine that you, in the now moment, are here to support that aspect of you. What would you say to the younger self? What would be your advice? What would be your way of supporting the younger self? I'm going to give you two minutes in silence to work with that aspect of the younger self. What is it that the younger self needs in this moment. And just bring all of your attention back into the now moment as you scan the circle, tuning into all the different ages. And just notice if there are any other parts of you that need extra attention. And you can communicate to the younger selves that you will return to work with them, to help them, to guide them, and just feel into that possibility that on a daily basis, you take a couple of minutes every day to tune into the younger selves, to really work with certain energies and programming to help them find their voice, to work with all the energies in the solar plexus, any residue of energies of control and manipulation, 
And just imagine that if you start working with the younger selves, how that is affecting you in the now moment. To just become aware of you and your body in the now moment, the sensations in the body. Tuning in on a daily basis, anything that has to do with control, manipulation, any victim consciousness, anything that affected your sense of confidence, worthiness, respect, self-respect. And how that is linked to any experiences you had as a child or young adult and how you can work with those aspects of yourself. And imagine opening up your heart, really opening up your heart to all the different ages. And communicating to all these aspects of you that you are ready to step in, support them, that you are here to listen, to see them, and tell them, you are part of me and I am part of you. And in order for me to step into the next level of what I want to accomplish, in life, what I want to create in my life, I need all of you with me. I need all of you in that same energy. And I am here to support you. And just imagine opening up your heart, being the mother and the father being this loving parent to all the younger selves and just inviting them to come into your heart space to come with you to your now moment to step onto that new timeline with you into wholeness noticing if there are any aspects of you that feel abandoned, that feel left out. And just asking them to join you in your heart space for healing, for transformation, however long it takes. There's no pressure. You're not rushing them. Just giving them all the time they need to just relax and step into a deeper level of healing. Just really inviting all these parts of you back home. And one last time, going Check in with all the younger selves if there is any part of you that has resistance. And just with love and kindness, letting them know that you are not here to pressure them. You are just here to love them, to work with the fears, to bring healing, to bring transformation into this now moment, this eternal now moment where you are all coming together. And for now, just imagining embracing all of the younger selves into your heart, coming back into your own body, pulling up that crystal energy through the base of the spine through all the different energy centers, the root, the sacral, solar plexus, the heart, the throat, the third eye, and the crown chakra. 
Setting your intention for harmony, coherence, and balance in all the different energy centers. And a couple more deep inhalations with the intention to bring harmony into your body. Allowing that beautiful crystal energy to continue to melt any of the frozen energies. Filling up the body on the deepest cell level with so much unconditional love. Pulling it from the center of the earth into the body. And feeling into your heart. Setting your intention for the rest of our time together. What is your intention? What is it that you wish to attract? What is it that you wish to release? Taking a few moments to really set your intention. Every breath is opening up the heart even more. Just imagine yourself in the center of that beautiful column of light that is connecting you with Mother Earth, with the great central sun, bringing all of that beautiful energy into your heart space. And feeling this level of unconditional love for yourself in all directions of time and space. In the now moment, all the way to when you were a baby inside of the womb, Feel that level of unconditional love for yourself right now. And set your intention that anybody that comes into your field, anybody that you will have a relationship with, will always match your level of self-love. So take it upon yourself to amplify and fortify your self-love on a daily basis, knowing that the people in your reality will match your level of self-love and self-respect. And this is the work. This is the work that we need to do on a daily basis. Last deep, slow breath in before we come back. Coming fully back into the body. Still connected to the earth, still connected to the great central sun, but coming back into this now moment in the room that you're at. Feeling your physical body sitting on a chair, on the couch. And when you're ready, you can open your eyes.